Good morning, early on families. This is Miss Jennifer here, and today we are going to be doing a little steam experiment I have here with me today, and it is going to be rock building. And what I did was I just collected some rocks. I went to my nearest beach or like shore, or you can check your backyard or around you in some forests, and I just collected some different kinds of rocks to build with. They could be big, they could be small, it could be whatever size you'd like. And as a little kind of extension is we're going to use some chalk with it. And so my friends, what you're going to need to do is you're just going to have to build. So the only thing you need is just some rocks, some simple um, normal size rocks. And you can have it on a flat surface, you can go outside for this on this beautiful nice day outside. And you, what you can do is you can start building your stack of rocks. So we got to start with the bottom base. So let's start with that. So we got our little base here. Let's see if I can get that for you guys to see a little bit. And there's one. So then we got our second one. So this is for like engineering, but also math because you're counting. So two, three, four. How many do you think we can get to? Oh, five, ooh, six, oh, maybe seven, seven, ooh, we got to seven. I got some more rocks here, but I'm just going to go to seven. I don't want to go too tall, but you can go as tall as you like and they'll fall over some of them, but just be careful. Sometimes they will chip, so you got to be very careful that this one doesn't come back at you. And some rocks are sharp. Um, so what I'm going to use as an extension, though, is I'm going to write numbers on all of our rocks here. And that's the order they can go. You can try to put them in. So I just have a piece of chalk here. And we're going to do some numbering here. So let's do, let's try this big one for one as well, for one. So let's put a number one here. So there's a one, so let's do one. This one can be a two. There's our two. Let's try this one being three. There's our three, our four. That one's a little bit hard to see, but you can see it. Five. And six. There's our sixth one. This one might be a little bit hard to see. Our sixth one and our seventh. There, we got seven rocks here and I marked them all. And you can also use this, it could also be art, it can be uh, engineering, it can be math, it can be multiple different ones in one. So now we gotta build with the numbers from going from one to seven. So let's start with one as our base. So then what comes after one? We got two. So then two is gonna go on top. Sometimes they're gonna be wobbly, so you gotta test them out. And then we got three. Ooh. So then we got four. Ooh, wobbly. And then five. Oops. And then six. Oh, mine almost fell over. Oh, sometimes you might have to turn it around, test it out to see how it's going to go. Oh, it's really wobbly. I might have to hold mine. Ooh, it's really wobbly. And seven. So this is seven rocks all on top. So you can go in different orders for rock building. And then you can also use as an extension is using some sticks or anything that you can find that you can stack with. It can be blocks, it can be rocks, it can be sticks, it can be anything that you have in your house as well. But my friends, that is our little simple um, activity today of rock building, is just finding some rocks outside at the beach or in your backyard or in a forest and just kind of having fun with them. You can even, for our littler ones, you can just get them to color with chalk on them and then wash them off. You can even put them in your garden afterwards to make your garden look pretty. Or you can do some rock painting. 
it kind of, it's endless. So I got like, I painted a rock here. Um, I have a few here, like I have one that's a, a hamburger that I made. And you can uh, do multiple different types of stuff with them to paint. I got one, another one here that says make a wish. There's, you can do so much with them. But uh, my friends, I hope you guys love this um, little steam activity. And I hope to see you guys next week with Miss Karen for another steam activity. Have a good one, families, and have a great weekend. Bye!